Hello and welcome to Foolish Vacation Designs. Before we begin, I'd appreciate it if you liked and subscribed and make sure to hit that bell icon to be notified of any future videos. All right, well, with the success of Stu's woodsy vacation home, we are now going to try and find ourselves a new client to create their perfect holiday home. Um, we are now here. Thank you very much for joining me. Hello, hello. Oh my gosh, they react in the background. It's so cute. Um, <laughs> um, first off, I would uh, like to say that I am thoroughly enjoying the creativity that comes with this particular job. I really, really am loving it a lot. Um, and just the fact that we get to meet some villagers that I myself wouldn't actually take on my islands in, like, in a general sense. So it's nice to see that we can meet new villagers, see what they're like, um, you know, and then you know design the design their holiday homes to their liking um, and it also gives us an, an idea of what their personality is like so you know in the future if we really want them to to live on our islands then we've had a little bit of an interaction with them to to find out what they're really like and um, and I'm really glad that uh, we get to meet all these different ones so far I'm seeing two different villages right now i am blanking on their names honestly but we've got a bunny and an ostrich just eager to get their vacation homes designed so without further ado let's go Alright, let's find ourselves a new client. Uh, every day would be so much fun if I had a home arcade. Ooh, an arcade. Wouldn't a home filled with yummy apples be totes cool? Apples for apple? Hmm. I want to do karaoke all night with my friends. We've got a, we've got a singing star. I'd like to be able to make fabulous cloth using a loom. Very interesting. Oh, I feel like... Is there anyone else? Is that it? I think that's it. Hold on. While we're here, I do remember Nico saying that we can find some DIYs. Oh, look at him. Look at Stu, Maple, Jacques living their best life on vacation or as we like to call it here in Australia holidays <laughs> we always go on a holiday we go holiday um, huh okay no DIY bottles okay fair enough we're gonna build a cafe hello Willow nice to meet you All right, let's see what Willow has to offer. A home for a coffee lover. I am gonna have fun with this one. Oh, 
Home for a coffee lover. All right. We are going to begin with um, with the exterior, which is what I like to do. And okay, so it goes as far as here. We probably won't be able to put it much over here. Uh, but without further ado, you are about to see a bit of a time lapse on the uh, on the exterior build. So I hope you enjoy it. Let's go.
right, I think we're good out here. I think I've spent a lot of time out here. <laughs> I think I, I'm gonna be spending a lot more time inside, I believe. So, uh, I think that should probably do it out here. I'm really loving the little cafe setup that I've got going on out here, uh, out on the front of the house. Uh, the design of the house looks really cute as well, I think. And then, you know, got a little seating area, um, you know, the, the, for those who don't want to be sitting at a table, they can chill out over here on the, on the sofa, um, with some extra sort of coffee ready to go. And then just this little simple sort of a walkway entrance, um, just to highlight, you know, the pathway into the cafe style home itself. So let's walk on indoors now and see what we can do with the interior. Alright, so what we have to work with here is this antique table. We have ourselves a, a coffee machine and of course a cup of coffee. Um, so let's get right into it and make ourselves a cute little cafe home.
liking the way this is looking. There's a lot of brown in here, but it kind of works with the with the green uh, wallpaper. And of course, I decided to go with an accent wall um, with the floral print wallpaper, which actually kind of works nicely with the green. Um, flooring didn't really have much to choose from. Willow's not very um, very big on flooring, it seems, especially not one that's. Uh, wood. Well, I suppose it doesn't really matter with all this other wood, like all this antique uh, furniture that's available here with the the chair and the bed and the vanity and all that sort of stuff. Um, I was going to go <laughs> with a cafe theme, but then I realized, I um, thought, well, if I was the one living here, I'd still want to have a place to sleep, right? <laughs> You'd still want a bed at least. Um, so, and of course with the only, with the limited amount of items I still have since this is only my, I believe, my either my fifth or my sixth, I think it's my sixth house that I have designed so far. Um, and uh, especially now at the moment I've still only got a limited amount of uh, f furniture items that I can use um, and, you know, other little items. Um, to place on top of surfaces. Um, there's only so much that I can do really. The um, I have to say I absolutely love the fact that we can put things on the ceiling now like uh, lighting and fans and all that sort of stuff. It's absolutely amazing. Um, so these little uh, lamps uh, that are the lighting fixtures that I've added on um, actually really complement the, uh, the room really nicely. That is pretty much the build for Willow. Let's uh, speak to Willow, see if she likes it, and we'll take a few photos and we'll wrap it up. All right, that is the end of another episode. Thank you so much for joining here today. I really appreciate it. Um, I really enjoyed building Willow's little coffee lover's home. Uh, I hope you I hope you like that as well. Let me know in the comments below what you thought of the build. Uh, or let me know uh, what you would have done for Willow. Uh, or if you have done uh, a build for Willow, let me know what you've done. Uh, I'd love to get some feedback on your thoughts on uh, what I've created. Um, and I'd love to hear about your creations. That would be amazing. Um, just a reminder to please like and subscribe if you haven't already and also make sure to hit that bell icon so you can be notified of future content that comes through on this channel um, in the meantime I'm gonna go and grab myself an iced coffee now and uh, I will see you all next time